Hi, my friends. I want to share with you a short story. It's an old Yiddish, an old Jewish story about a town, a town that was known for its grapes and the most exquisite wine they would create, the most exquisite wine they would make. And one day they got an announcement that the king, they received the message that the king of the country was going to come to their town to honor them to taste their wine. So the townspeople decided that in honor of the king, they would build a massive golden goblet, a massive golden cup in the center of town, and that each member of the town would bring a barrel of wine and pour it into this goblet. Well, the butcher decided, you know, everyone else is going to bring their barrel of wine. It doesn't really make a difference if I do or not. I'm just going to bring a barrel of water instead. No one's going to know. The king is not going to notice. I'm just one person. Everyone else is going to bring their wine. Unfortunately, the butcher didn't realize that the local tailor was thinking the same thing. And so was the local baker, and so was the local peddler, and of course, unfortunately, each of them thinking that they're the only one and every, that, to bring water and everyone else will do their job, each of them brought a barrel of water. And you can imagine how embarrassed they were when the king comes and the goblet is only filled with water. And of course, it's a life's message that many times in life we say to ourselves, someone else will take care of it, someone else will do it. And what we have to realize is that the way God made the world is that each of us have to take responsibility. It takes a village. It takes every member of the village. This is what we're told we learn from the creation of one man, Adam. God creates the world. There is only one man. There is only Adam. And God was trying to teach us that like Adam, we have to realize Adam didn't have the luxury to say someone else will take care of it. Adam had to know, ultimately, this is me. This is my responsibility. This is on, my, on me. And that each of us has to live in that way where we take personal responsibility. So I'd like to ask each of you to take a few moments, if you can, to support the end-of-year match campaign that we're running right now. It takes a village to really support all the wonderful work we try to do whether it's through the Hebrew school children, the camp for the children, the adult education programs, these videos, classes, the, works, the work we do with seniors in the community. We need the support of every member of our village. And if, if each of you can take a few moments to go to ChabadOfKab.com forward slash match. So again, ChabadOfKab.com forward slash match. I'll post it on the bottom here. It would be greatly appreciated. Remember, it takes a village. Every single penny, every single person counts. Thank you so much.